Where do new words come from? Learning goal. Students will be able to learn key words and context from this TED video, Where do new words come from? Have you ever wondered how new words are created or where they come from? Every now and then, there are new words popping up on television or on the internet. Approximately 1,000 new words are added each year to the Oxford Dictionary. Even though there are about 170,000 English words which are currently in use, new ideas and inventions appear constantly. People need words to express brand new concepts. One of the ways to create new words is by simply taking words from other languages. Legal and religious words are mostly taken from French and Roman in the medieval times. In fact, about half of all English words originate from other languages. Another way is giving classical words a new meaning. Scientists alter ancient words and give them a new meaning. Take the word anesthetic, for instance. It comes from an ancient Greek word, anesthetos, which means insensible. Combining existing words is another way to make new words. There are two methods to combine words. One is to stick two words together and make a compound word, like superstructure and commonplace. The other is to merge two into one, which is called a portmanteau. Words like cosplay, costume plus role play, and Brexit, Britain plus exit, are portmanteaus. Moreover, old words are being given new meanings. The word geek used to be a performer in a carnival, but now it means someone who is interested in a particular subject. In order to be sarcastic, some old words even mean the opposite of their original meaning. Both wicked and sick can be used to describe things that are amazingly impressive. In short, new words are created every day. People can easily understand the meaning of some new words. Other words require a search on Google. No matter what, the origins of new words are just as fascinating as the meanings themselves.